Before we can control Zack Track from our console, we will need fixture profiles for all the features we talked about in the last section. These profiles will be built based on the DMX traits of Zack Track. There are three fixture types you will need. The Zack Fixture, the Zack Tag, and the Zack Seam. When patching these, generally it is easiest to give all of them DMX addresses in the same separate universe. One Zack fixture is patched for each fixture in your show you want to be controlled by Zack Track. All the attributes this profile contains were discussed in the Zack fixture features video. This profile has a DMX footprint of 11. The first and most important channel controls which tracker the fixture is following. This is the assignment function we looked at in the live settings for our fixture. Crossfade is a 16-bit attribute, so it takes up two channels. It will crossfade between the console's position and Zack Track's position, or merge the value somewhere in the middle. Transition time will give the fixture timing as its assignment changes between trackers. All the offset attributes are also 16-bit, giving us precise control over the amount of offset. Lastly, we use channel 11 to choose which merge mode the fixture will use. We need one Zack tag patched for each tag used in your show. And if you're also using the pucks as tags, you will want to patch one for each puck as well. This fixture profile has a DMX footprint of five and consists of all 8-bit channels. You will have height for a Z offset on the tracker, speed preset for the amount of prediction you want on the fixtures, smart beam for automatic beam sizing, freeze to dampen the amount of movement the lights do, and tag mode to determine if a tracker is active or inactive. These will also live on our dedicated control universe with the Zack fixtures. Our last fixture is only a single DMX channel. It is the Zack scene and is used to toggle between different auto function scenes during the show. You will need these profiles built for your particular console brand before you begin patching your show on the console. Attached to the Zack Track's console resource lesson, you will find some profiles for a few common consoles, such as GrandMA2, GrandMA3, EOS Family, and HOG4. If you need to build them for another console, we've also attached the DMX traits.